is it visible to you yes sir yes sir now oh, career opportunity in agriculture we will test to this topic now as you know india is principally an agriculture country 70% indian population lives in villages 59% work base the workforce depends on agriculture for its daily bread and around 14% gross gdp is contributed by agriculture now as you know that india is self sufficient in food grain production but this was not the situation uh when we got the independence in 1947 early we had 57 million tons of food grain productions and we were uh, dependent on other country in terms of uh, in terms of food grain production and uh, many country they were thinking that india is a beggar in terms of food grain because early 57 million tons but as you know our area that is uh, 329 million hectare that is not increase agriculture area that is being reducing but we got the green revolutions in 1965 onwards because of the efforts of uh, scientists just like swaminathan many scientists from universities icias farmers uh, ngos different companies and presently not simply self sufficient but we are exporting uh, some food grain productions uh, food grains to other country also so this has been changed because of the uh, development in terms of varieties in terms of irrigation modern irrigation systems ipm integrated pest management then uh, integrated farming then in many ways we got the development and nowadays we are we got that uh, around 310 to 315 million tons so more than five times of food grain productions even though the area is reduced india has it the world's largest cattle herd buffaloes largest area planted to wheat rice and cotton largest producer of milk pulses and spices second largest producer of fruit vegetables tea palm fish cotton sugar cane wheat rice cotton and sugar agriculture sector in india holds the record for second largest agricultural land in the world generating employment for over half the country's population the indian food processing industry accounts for 32% of the country's total food market and uh because of the that uh, less facility or not sufficient uh, wood homes storage facility we are losing our food grains or the process uh, materials around 20 to 30% in terms of export the sector has seen good growth in last year in say in financial year 20, uh, 2022 until december 2021 exports of the marine products stood at uh, us dollars around 6.12 billion exports of the rice basmati and non basmati around 6.12 billion then buffalo meats around 2.51 billion sugar exports 2.78 billion us dollars tea exports stood at 570 0.15 million poppy exports 719 i mean this uh, this much exports we had in 2021 the new millennium india one out of every 8 rupees earned through the exports owes its origin to agriculture an outstanding achievement as it happened despite an unabated populations builds up 
up at a rate of 2.15 percent per year, or 13 million more mouths to feed to be fed every year, uh, more than the populations of Australia. Not only in food grain productions, but the country has made revolutionary progress in milk, fish, eggs, fruits, and vegetables as as well. So. It is the self-sufficiency, uh, sufficiency as we discussed earlier, in food that has raised the international status of India. Employment services twenty-one percent, manufacturing eleven percent, others one percent, agriculture sixty-seven percent. You simply imagine that one. How uh, much scope we have? Uh, in agriculture, then the different agriculture state university, team university, then uh, uh, central university under ICA, that is the apex body in agriculture, Indian Council of Agriculture Research from New Delhi. So it has institutions 65, National Research Center 14, National Bureau 6, Directors, Project Directors 13, 63 State Agriculture University, 4 Deem University, 3 Central University with Agriculture Faculties. Out of 63 State Agriculture University, Maharashtra has 4 universities, as you know that, from Akula, from Rauri. Parbani and the Podi. And different agriculture constituent colleges, government colleges, agriculture engineering colleges, then uh, forestry, then horticulture college, different colleges, uh, government colleges, and affiliated uh, private colleges. ICR, as we discussed that, ICR, that is the uh, apex body in agriculture. Then earlier it was known as Imperial Council of Agriculture Research. It was established in 16th July 1929. And as we discussed earlier, that uh, we got the uh, food grain production 5.6 times, horticulture crops by 10.5 times, fish by 16.8 times, milk by 10.4 times, and eggs by 52.9 times since uh, 1950 to uh, 51 to 17. To uh, 18, uh, and that's why we got the green revolutions. We got the white revolution, blue rural revolutions. Uh, that we can say uh, white revolutions, operation flood uh, because of the efforts of the Norman Burgess uh, Kurian from NDDB National Dairy Development Board. So you know that one. Uh, in many ways, we got the uh, self sufficiency, and, and that uh, uh, you can say we are at the stage now to. Uh, send our product products and that is accepted uh, throughout the world. Now, present we are at that stage. Then, the linkage. Despite this opting rise, farmers still need input services, which includes technical input. Technically, well qualified agri graduates are in the great demands, public sector mix, agri industry, educational institutes, consultancy services. Agriculture University, as uh, you know, MPQ Rauri, uh, it was established in 1969. PDQ Akula, 69. Parvani, 72. And PSKQ with Akuli, that is also 1972. Nature of agriculture industry, goods and services. Agriculture industry includes two large subsectors, crop productions and animal production, plus three smaller subsections, forestry and lodging fishing, then agriculture support activities. Establishment in agriculture. Establishments in agriculture, forestry, and fishing include farms, dairies, greenhouses, nurseries, and orchards, and hatcheries. Then new business and new issues. To succeed in the 21st century, industry must address the following issues. Having skilled workers and uh, technical graduates, 
uh, then uh, you can say uh, the expertise we want uh, in different fields because as you know in each field nowadays because of the uh, competition uh, multinationals companies uh, in pune also so definitely uh, we, we must have the skill workers high productivity top quality lower cost low cost technology you can say this person is to market means uh, as per the uh, demand supply should be planned able to uh, do business globally just like uh, one of the successful example from Pitek, uh, agriculture engineering from dr anna sahib shinde uh, one villa shinde he was earlier uh, he started his business with uh, four uh, friends earlier he, uh, he did not get the success but later on as you know that one so uh, presently he has the uh, one um, sahad reforms in nashi so definitely that uh, able to do the business globally able to uh, to outsource having local partners capable to integrate new era new requirements globalization dictates the speeds as the key factors for business advantage and being first on the market before competitors driven by the demands of the competitive global business environment fundamental change is taking place in the education and the applications of technology to business education institutes uh, institutions must adjust their curriculum to address new demands as you know that one earlier the syllabus was not uh, as per the requirement but uh, because of the different committee just like food deans committee food deans committee as you uh, some students fresh students might be knowing that this syllabus is being changing uh, through the ICS and different committees and as per the uh, suitability as per the uh, present need uh, just like we got nowadays rave we got uh, experimental learning so these are nothing but the educational institutes must adjust their curriculum to address new demands as per the demand and then transition from personal learning to team learning transition from theoretical to practical because nowadays uh, throughout one year students are going to different companies and also uh, interactions with the farmers in uh, different villages ravi and that for one year earlier it was only six months <clears throat> transition from the independent system to integrated system focus transition from personal computing to network computing then factors influencing learning and career government policy and requirement funding and initiative professional groups affiliations extracurricular activities students interest and motivation skills and ability attitude and value needs forms college faculty advisors role models curriculum academic environment facilities society and culture family friends role models em employers job requirements real world experience salary and benefits work environmental mentoring career i mean out of this optimum things you have to decide that one considering all the uh, your uh, pros and cons and the requirement uh, required things and out of that you you need to find the best uh, solution out of this with optimum solution you can say agri graduates of the modern century general knowledge and life experience now uh, now it days you know uh, the computer internet emails like that just like today uh, this online lectures and we had the online lectures uh, during the corona also so definitely uh, as per the change and uh, as per the uh, available facilities amenities that we, we should grab that one at the uh, utmost level uh, so as to get our uh, so as to achieve the goals then general knowledge and life experience then foundational technical skills technical specialty skills scientists and uh, technocrats professional skills business skills projects managers extension services technical experts these are attributes of agri graduates good understandings of agriculture science fundamentals when you are coming to this course then uh, definitely uh, you need to uh, plan plan such that in any field any field you are going that one you can be the one of the top at that but you need to uh, go through the proper channels proper ways by taking uh, all these parameters then good understanding of the agriculture science fundamental just like agronomy 
uh, different crops, uh, different just like pulses, then cereals like that, then uh, their package of practices and uh, cultivation uh, means conditions, cultivation parameters, and accordingly getting the maximum uh, productions per unit area, but protecting the ecology. Agriculture, engineering, and technology, just like irrigation, soil water conservation, then uh, different machineries, post harvest technologies, then remote sensing like that, then soil science, uh, the physical, chemical uh, properties of that one, uh, different zones, uh, different uh, uh, just like altitude or like that, then texture, structure, various that, and accordingly applying the irrigation to field capacity or uh, that testing of the soil and accordingly applying the fertilization to fertigations uh, by reducing the wastage of that one. Entomology, different uh, uh, insects. Uh, we can go for the uh, biological control also, plant pathology, just like here also, information technology. It's nowadays uh, different models, uh, different uh, mass media, and uh, this nowadays internet, and that uh, from whole world, you can have the uh, applications of information technology. Nowadays, you can get some of the uh, through satellites, uh, some radio waves or that geostationary satellites. You can reissue whatever the information you want. Suppose you are interested to have some location. And if you want to have uh, the 10 years back, what was the cropping pattern there? From the uh, Google software, uh, Earth Explorer software, you can take the imagery from that one and you can study that. Which crop was there? What was the intensity? And what was the I mean, uh, how much area was covered under what crops? Anything can be possible nowadays in term, uh, through the information technology and applications of the, these different models uh, from this one uh, in crop productions. Good understandings of the productions and post harvest processes, horticulture and floriculture. Uh, nowadays, you know that one, just like Alfonso Mango. So, different products and that uh, shelf life can be extended. Good processing. Uh, value added products, logistics, good understanding of the context in which agriculture is practiced, economics, uh, more benefit cost ratio, business uh, that uh, profit oriented, then history of that, uh, in uh, of any uh, where you are going that one. Uh, so, uh, since uh, start of that one up to that up to now or in future also, what will be the changing pattern, just like in case of the uh, climate change, how to adjust yourself, how to adjust this crop. Uh, in the changing climate by considering all the weather parameters and accordingly your technology will be like that then. Then, environment, because uh, crop, soil, water, and definitely this environment, uh, what uh, uh, environmental factors, humidity, temperature, then uh, can say uh, pressures, uh, if it is in uh, poly house or like that, then <clears throat> then uh, sunshine hours, uh, minimum thermometer, maximum th th thermometers, minimum temperature, maximum temperature, then evaporation, then evapotranspiration, all the parameters can be studied. And nowadays you will find that uh, auto uh, records, or uh, you, will you will be finding this uh, with through the sensor, you can get the uh, climatic uh, requirement, and accordingly you can adjust the uh, crop cultivations. Farmers needs, customers needs, uh, different uh, cards, different um, just like BHNL, idea, whatever that then you are getting the ready made uh, information, uh, advisory services, then uh, customers needs and societal needs. Accordingly, you can plan that good communication skills, returns, and oral because. Uh, uh, whenever you are going to appear for any interview, nowadays you might be knowing that and you are going through that, then uh, you can have such type of online interview uh, throughout the world. And if it is uh, the scheme is uh, up to that level, definitely you will be getting the your uh, chance in that uh, respective company or respective uh, offices or uh, higher education also, just like from my society. Uh, some two, three students, they went for Ireland, some are planning for the Germany uh, through the online interview. And um, they are getting their uh, MS, uh, MBA uh, from the outside uh, with the 
this online interview and that communication skill definitely that uh, uh, that will be the added parameters then graphics listening high ethical standards ability to things and nowadays uh, this is not the mugging or remembering that one now we need to have the interpretation if you uh, get some uh, topic or like that and uh, not uh, to simply define that or the theoretical things but uh, definitely interpretations that is the must one understanding the topic Uh, thoroughly and with your own ideas nowadays that is the uh, that matters then flexibility self confidence it doesn't mean that you are going for the upsc and if uh, you are getting failed two three times or like that it doesn't mean that you should be restricted to that only you can come to mpsc also you can have some different field also and uh, as i mentioned earlier any field uh, you, you can be at the top also just like when we joined this uh, university in 1987 Uh, during those days, we were planning uh, to go outside. Uh, that foreign was the very much attraction. But uh, uh, initially, three four years, we were just like first trusted it. Why to come to a certain profession like that? But uh, now it is. Sir, uh, yes. Ha. Uh, PPT is not movable, sir. Moving. Yes. Now. Yes. No, sir. Uh, can you stop your share screen and uh, restart it? Yes, no. No, sir. It's not moving. So it is not not visible. Yes, it's visible, sir, but it's not moving. Ah, sir. Now, which one opportunity in services? Whether this is there? Um, sir, it's actually at the first slide. So, if possible, can you please unshare your screen and then share again? Might be now. Which time. screen is visible? Whether it is good communication skill, high ethical standard. Whether that screen is there? Yes, sir. We can see it, but it's at the first slide only. Uh, I'm uh, two slides here now. Once again, share. Yes, yeah, sir. I have. Hmm? No, it's coming out of that. Ah, uh, sir. I have st uh, stopped your share screen. Please share it now. Now. Is it visible? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's totally visible. Uh, whether the screen, I mean, sir, uh, slide is good communication skills. Fourth number. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We, we okay. High yes. thinker standards, ability to think, flexibility, desire to learn for life, teamwork, global awareness. Now opportunities in R and D: seeds, diseases, remedies, irrigation, and water management. Farm machinery, fertilizers, different companies. Uh, nowadays, multinational companies, and in each whether it is seeds company, whether it is M S S C, Maharashtra State Seed Corporations, or some uh, different fertilizer, whatever they are then, then uh, diseases and remedies, different uh, uh, insecticides, pesticides, biological uh, pesticides. So you can uh, have uh, this. opportunity in that related company irrigation water management just like net of him then uh, drain irrigation uh, premier irrigation uh, from israel dan irrigation farm machinery uh, john dere uh, many uh, cafe uh, then fertilizer as we discussed that uh, fertilizers other, other companies also myco ipo like that then quarantine and regulatory affairs green laws farm laws uh, you are having some scope in uh, different laws of different company also there is uh, one course uh, graduations also just like my uh, relative uh, that uh, nimple bansor she got the 33 lakh package uh, she had the law course i mean uh, she did that uh, llb from the company laws then uh, high tech agriculture precision farming nowadays if you go to kadegaon you will find the number of green houses and the productions per unit area one of my friend uh, sir wahane uh, he has Uh, 2.5 acres of green houses. Simply imagine that five gunta, ten gunta, and you know one acre is nothing but the forty gunta, and hundred gunta is one hectare. So he got 2.5 acres of, and he is exporting that one after retirement also. Precision farming, biotechnology, bio fertilizers, bioinformatics, transfer of technology, agriculture education, uh, media studies, uh, then agriculture and corporate uh, education. then teaching just like this now 
uh, today we are having this uh, platform uh, you will be in doing that uh, bajus classes like that so in uh, world amongst the uh, 10 or 15 earlier he was the uh, fourth number now i don't get the baju or at what position but uh, in such the teaching profession or online classes or classes of that one that is also one of the profession uh, you can have the different videos just like one of my students sri premrat chawan he is conducting the classes online classes he was simply the bsc from pune agriculture college but he is conducting in baramati the number of students are coming in that field also then opportunity in services farm advisory technical consultants consultancy plant and crop diseases diagnosis plant tissue culture lab in agriculture colonies pune if you come over there then tissue culture mini stem culture will find such type of labs nursery and landscape then commercial production project preparation media services banking and uh, financial services uh, since uh, last month in my college in shirnami hall that uh, different uh, entry of the banking is going on now presently for uh, six seven day earlier in last month also means uh, uh, you are uh, studying that uh, banking examination and in different banks whether it is sbi rbi a number of banks and you, you can have the uh, good uh, job there also professional officer at scale one scale two up to agm gm also and formation and maintenance input supply then in industry sales marketing product support project management finance management human resource development agriculture industry agriculture and uh, processing industry alternate agri business uh, agro tourism uh, that uh, tawre from baramati uh, i had on my lecture uh, before 67 years so one gender group was there and they were uh, for uh, two three days living in that a small village in that sm small farm house and students were very i mean that uh, uh, company staff was very interested were very, very interested to know about the how to feed the animals uh, how to have uh, what are the different technologies there then so how to apply the irrigation and that that agri business uh, agro tourism uh, that is also a uh, good opportunity then entrepreneurship development dairy commercial sheep and goat rearing, retail markets, and many areas for considerations, farms, farm management, uh, then production and marketing management, with private farms, corporate farms, government farms, and now we have watershed base also. If you know that from the Radigan Shikti, then Huri Vazas, uh, watershed, uh, good ideal watershed from my university also, Mahatma Kula Kushi, David Rauri, uh, before, uh, I came here in this Pune Agriculture College and uh, also director of research in Kaneshkin. I was in the Rauri, but we have developed uh, 2,380 acres of the watershed farms uh, development uh, through the other Shigao uh, Yojana and with the gratis from that other Shigao. So it was farm management, farm development. And definitely, if you develop the farms, uh, that watershed, that area contributing runoff to the common outlet. If you develop that one with the soil water conservation methods, integrated approach, definitely uh, that is also the good opportunity. Then areas for the consideration, agro, agro industry, trades, fertilizers, agri agrochemicals, insurance, machinery, factors, media, internet. Then areas for consideration in research and uh, teaching, ICA, uh, Indian Council of Agriculture Research, then uh, uh, DST, then uh, CIS, IR state and central labs, universities, private labs, then areas for considerations in farm advisory and consultancy also, state and central institutes, private institutes, self-entrepreneurship uh, unit, plant tissue culture lab, plant and crop dishes, diagnosis lab, essential oil extraction units, dairy, poultry, commercial mushroom productions and processing, and value addition unit, then apiary, sericulture, vermicompost units, and like that, uh, many other things. Then, central and state government, state and central departments of agriculture, line department, which you can kendra. Uh, uh, last month, uh, we had in uh, Narayanga. Then, 
Yeah, to select one associate professor that in uh, head of the uh, KVK, we selected that one day. But uh, that is also nothing but just like the scientist uh, getting the good salary in KVK also and good jobs, just like in uh, universities also. Nowadays, you will find an assistant professor, senior assistant professor, associate professor, professor, head, uh, HOD, you can say, head or HOD. But on the same, then associate deans, dean, uh, that is also, I mean, uh, such type of jobs. In, uh, scientist uh, field also uh, scientists senior scientists principal scientists like that state and central government schemes insurance adi and village industry upsc mpc agriculture scientist recruitment board what we discussed earlier uh, srb staff selection board railway recruitment board defense banks professional officer selection agriculture industrial development finance and corporation then non-governmental organizations kvk then uh, research labs, rural scheme, agriculture scheme, agriculture education institutions, then academia, uh, university and colleges, state and central government institutions, national institutes of agriculture management, manage, samiti, agriculture education media research institutions, mass media educational institutions. Then classifications of the comp different companies. Uh, it may not be the sufficient one, might be some company might have added and uh, each year uh, different companies are added and that uh, progress of each company that might be the different one. But uh, whatever the companies related to this field, agriculture, fertilizers, seeds, plantations, fisheries, seafood supplier, dairy products, meat and poultry, food product, pesticides, vegetable oils. Then uh, uh, some companies Promandal fertilizers, DCM Siriram Consolidated, Gujarat Narmada Valley fertilizers, Indogal fertilizers, Jain Irrigations, Trishek Bharti, Madras fertilizers, Mangalore Chemicals, Relish India, and Singenta, Zuari, Gujarat, then Premier, then Jain Irrigation, uh, I have taken already, that uh, Neta Fame, then uh, uh, Agriculture Fertilizer, Dairy, Fire, Crop Science, Unchan so other stock companies in agriculture, this, uh, once again, I'm telling, this may, might not be the sufficient one, that, that might be some uh, different company also, you can get from the uh, Google, you can search, and we can have the different ratings and views of that one, and that, uh, uh, just like Sahedri also, then Aero, Agrochemicals, Agro Extracts, Agro India, Alpha, Iritech, Aquaculture Authority, AMQ Agro India, Eco Agro Products, Chakra, Kimino India, Devidayal Agrochemicals, Global International, Areas for Conservation, International Organizations, FAO, Food and Agriculture Organization, ADB, Asian Development Bank, International Finance Corporations, Private Farm, Educational Institutes, that uh, World Banks also, IMA, uh, International Monetary Funds, then uh, but uh, while going through that one, uh, any field, uh, as you know that one, definitely you need to commit yourself with uh, hard work, take academic seriously and specialize, try to learn and know more than the regular syllabus, take up available opportunity, apply to small firms and company, your ability will secure a job for you, try to learn a foreign language other than the English, then on your communications and computer skill. Beside this, you need to have the extracurricular activity, then uh, versatile development, uh, just like sometimes sports, sometimes uh, meditation, sometimes cultural activity. Uh, so definitely that will add to your personality and you will be the successful person uh, and you will be getting, you will be achieving your uh, respective goals. So, Madam, hello. Yes, sir. Uh, so should we stop here or go to some another topic also? So what is your time now? We um, so uh, we can do one thing. We have a few questions from the participants, if possible. Okay, if there are some of the questions, uh, so that will be uh, definitely welcome. That's it. Uh, sir, there's a question. Uh, what kind of railway recruitment uh, board offers jobs? Can you speak loudly? Actually, I'm getting. Yes. Yeah. 
Uh, sir, the question is, uh, what kind of jobs does Railway Recruitment Board offers to Agri graduates? Railway Railway Recruitment Board. Yes, sir. Agriculture uh, Railway. Actually, uh, I don't know exactly from that railway. There were some competitors. Some students uh, from Vitek they went as some some station master like that there. But uh, uh, related to agriculture, uh, presently I don't know that one. Uh, we can search that. But uh, just like other companies, then uh, other uh, different company from Pune also in Hinjwadi in uh, sir. But in railway, uh, I, I will also search that one because I don't have that idea of the railway uh, because he is just a ticket collector or some food. Uh, in in case of the food, uh, if the testing the food quality, uh, just like if uh, some students from the food technology or some uh, from the processing. So under that case might be there then, but as such uh, in railway, uh, administrative through MPC, UPC might be there then, uh, just uh, uh, through this uh, competitive exams. But for agriculture in railway as such, uh, just like in companies which are producing the crops or that food, food in productions, but as such in railway, uh, I don't know presently that one. I will search and uh, I will let you know. Uh, right, sir. Uh, sir, there's another question. The question mm -hmm. is, uh, you know, as freshers, a lot of people think they should join MNCs, uh, you know, for getting experience. Uh, but also, on the other hand, there are a lot of startups that have a lot of learning to offer. So, which one should the freshers choose? Should they go for MNCs or startups to, you know, look for experience? Means, uh, just like the, I refer the case of. Uh, Shinde, Vila Shinde. So actually, he started that one, but uh, initially uh, he was flopped. Just like one uh, Shamal Kuntam from Agriculture Pune. Uh, then many students initially, even they, they get some failure, but uh, uh, not simply alone. I mean, groups you can have that. But if uh, some loan facility or like that, then so you can plan for that also, but related to agriculture, huh? I mean, some uh, food uh, productions or uh, whatever the uh, value addition, or uh, you can go uh, for that one. But depending upon the um, uh, that uh, locations or that uh, market um, uh, demands, because uh, many times you will find that uh, there are ups and downs. But uh, by entering any such type of things, you need to uh, know the that related background of that one related experience of your seniors huh? and uh, nobody should time mean, is uh, comments myself or anybody can you go for this one or this one or not that time sometimes you will find the successful uh, persons in that sometimes you can find uh, the uh, failures also as i referred that one i was not uh, interested to come over in this you know city field teaching field earlier we were planning to go outside then because we, uh, because of the having the mtech from iit for that uh, my friends were there then but uh, when I uh, I miss uh, here, I work now a stage. I can say you that uh, this is the one of the best field uh, because I got the number of awards, including national best teachers also. Wherever you go, that one. So that is that is not the comparative one. Means you go for this one, you select for this one. That depends upon the person, and you can create your own. Uh, if you are uh, sincerely in that, then. there are not the specific thing that just like two into two multiplied by four. This is not the things. Hmm? Just like nowadays that. Uh, and share markets earlier uh, some uh, three four months back so what was that one now so uh this is not the, that exactly things huh right right sir it's a good uh so there's a question from bhushan singh the question is are there any research opportunities in pune this is opportunity huh? definitely in university jra uh junior research fellow sra a senior research fellow then uh, if you have that uh, M Tech or M E, I mean uh, uh, M S C with NET hmm? uh, National Eligibility Test, so definitely there are a lot of scope in university. Number of colleges uh, you will find that earlier hardly four university and some uh, three four colleges under one university, but nowadays you will find more than 170 private colleges, huh? and uh, many students they are uh, undergoing this uh, projects in uh, B Tech or B S C or MSc, huh? especially MSc, a PhD. So as a research guide, as a research, uh, every you will find in my own uh, research station, 
you will find there are eight research stations number of varieties are developed uh, just like your uh, that pomegranate variety only one variety of that sugar cane 265 that uh, thousands of crores even though uh, we, uh, we are not hunting in terms of money but uh, three four years back so we had the impact analysis of three four variety in Mahatma Pula Kushu they would round a 90,000 crore rupees where the benefit due to the variety so uh, definitely not simply in this university but in ICR also Indian Council of Agriculture Research uh, Education and Research huh? ICR uh, Agriculture Research you will find number of post, scientists then uh, senior scientists, principal scientists, many students, one student from Shiv, Alok Shiv from this one, uh, uh, Pune College, he is now the scientist. Many students are there, the, my own students also, uh, those uh, did MTech and PhD uh, under my guidance, they are now in the good uh, uh, stations. So in Maharashtra also, in uh, at, uh, Asher level also. So definitely there is a lot of scope there. You can say in the, uh, if you also such type of international organizations also uh, right sir right sir got that uh, so one last request uh, like a student uh, we got a certain re request from the participants uh, can you tell us more on the lines of uh, let's say uh, like generally a lot of students they go into the job sector after graduation so should mm. they first pursue more higher studies or it's fine going into the job section? Uh, okay. Actually, what's the one? Mm, one? I will put some example also. Uh, my own example also. When uh, I was a uh, MTech, then uh, other were the PTech. Some professors were PTech. But during those days, better was sufficient. Then uh, they did not uh, do the MTech, but after later on they did that one. Then I went to PhD because I had uh, MTech already. Now the uh, that uh, requirement in teaching field, at least PhD for a system professor. So my those uh, uh, my own friends who did uh, MTech with me in Kharagpur, they are simply a system professor. Now uh, PhD is the must be. Uh, sometimes you can have the higher study through uh, through I mean through the office also if some company or some uh, uh, institutes. They are giving you such type of facility. You get the job firstly and go for that uh, higher study uh, then also. But if the minimum requirement is the MSc or PhD nowadays in this one, or in uh, company also, if you are getting some uh, MSc good job, just like uh, my own daughter, uh, she got the good package after doing uh, M uh, MBA from Kumba University. And the BTEX, they were getting the less package. You have to decide that in which field you are going. So if you are coming to university, education is the must one, the higher study. If you are going to some good jobs and that good company, you want the experience only, you take firstly the job, join that job there. And after then, you can have the uh, higher study. Otherwise, uh, waiting for that higher study and that you are leaving some job, you are not accepting that one. It doesn't mean that after getting higher study and directly you are getting the job. You grab the opportunity firstly. But uh, if it is university or a research institute, definitely you must have the higher study. If it is some company or like that, just like MPC, if you are going for the MPC and yes, uh, simultaneously you are going for the higher study, you are wasting two years for higher study. But if you uh, study for the two years for MPC, definitely you will be getting the good job. Under that case, no any education, higher education is required. And later on, in uh, some agriculture, MPC also, just like okay, Dr. Kailash Mothi is the director now. He, he was the doctor. He she did that one day. Uh, now one change of my own friend. Uh, he retired from as a joint director in agriculture. He, he did the MPC during those days. Now after retirement also, he, he had joined PhD of law in Pune University. That day he came to me and uh, he did the LLM. And now after retirement also, you can get the degree. But if the degree is required for that field, definitely go for the degree. But uh, considering the financial condition, considering your parents' condition, and you are going for the higher education and higher education, your financial condition is not that one. So what would uh, your relative uh, or your parent will be expecting something from you? So you need to uh, think about that also, not comparatively with your friends. Somebody is doing that. That decision you have to take, right? Yes.
right sir right sir we clearly got that and with that we thank you sir for giving us uh, an insightful session as well as you know all those tips and tricks on uh, the career guidance to all the participants we thank you so much sir for joining us today okay thanks thank thanks you. to organizer dr priti madam you all then and thanks all the participants okay oh. thank you so much so can i leave now uh, yes sir Uh, thank you sir for your insightful session thank you sir uh before ending today's session i want to recall the contribution of all the speakers who joined with us till date this event could not become possible without 